Hello, and welcome to Nadia's Molten Imaginings. Today I am going to be showing you how to paint with the encaustic wax painting iron, and I'm going to be taking you through some of the basic techniques and mark making that can be achieved with this flat bottomed iron. Now for some basic mark making. The iron has several parts. The tip of the iron, which is pointed and can be used for drawing some quite fine and detailed lines. The way to hold the iron when drawing is with the handle behind, just to give you more control and precision. The edges of the iron are also good for drawing straight lines. Another basic technique you can use with the iron is a dabbing effect. This creates wonderful shapes and patterns and the edges can also be dragged along to create undulating lines and motions. Now it's time to get painting. So first of all we take our iron and hold it flat so that the base of the iron is face up and we take a colour, a basic dark colour which will show up and we load the base of the iron with this colour. Make sure the wax melts fluidly and evenly over the surface. Now we spread it over our card. You can spread it until you get. Sometimes you don't get any more coverage, and that's alright. This is just an used to feel of the iron and how it drags across the paper. If you are used to ironing clothes, you may want to press quite hard, but it's a very gentle gliding motion. And you can spread the wax and you can see all these wonderful shapes and patterns appearing in the wax. On our same piece of card, we will load the iron again. This time, instead of smoothly brushing across the surface of the card, wiggle the iron slightly to let it go. We've got some lovely lines going on. There are other marks you can make. Load up the iron. You can also do a wiggle pattern, also using the point. This creates another ridge, luckily. You don't have to load up this colour every time, you can work into what you've got. There's a dabbing technique. Which creates these sharp lines. And foliage effects. You could sweep up and get something quite remarkable. You can tuck in with the side and make sharp. Scribble with the point. 
surface of the paper, I'm just using a bit of back quarter. We can create Just this one black iron. So beware when you're using this one card for several effects. When you cut in with the edge, sometimes the cut marks will be left. You see that they have like a little trace. Let's try this. How do we unify this card? By wiping everything off with a tissue. And all that's left are the traces and the scrapes made by the eye. Thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe for more fun wax art.